Skinny girls weak, the models don't compare Junk in the trunk looking like two pairs All I do is stay up all night Losing sleep over you, you Okay, you guys, so this is what we're going to be using to make my version of the feta pasta. I've seen everybody doing it either just plain or with shrimp. I thought I'd switch it up some and use some steak in mine because I had some steak I need to use. So I'm going to see if I can elevate the recipe a little bit, okay? So first off, I have some steak. I have a red onion, some olive oil, my seasoning blend if you don't have my seasoning blend you can of course order it from the link in the description box below i do have eight ounce bottles available so if you don't have my seasoning you can of course use um some adobo with pepper um i have some italian seasoning i have a chunk of feta this is not the crumbles this is a whole solid piece right here some grape tomatoes minced garlic some penne, some parsley to garnish, and that's it. We're about to make a bomb, quick, one-pot pasta. Oh, and you guys, I'm doing mine on the stove. So this is going to be like a one-pot dish, all right? Minus the fact that I'm going to make the pasta separate. But pretty much an all-in-one dish. We're going to do it stove top, not in the oven. Easy peasy, right? All right, let's get to it. Let's uh, cook up the steak. All right, so I have my pan here heating up. I'm gonna go ahead and add some olive oil. All right, let that heat up. Okay, so my pan is nice and hot. I'm gonna go ahead and add the steak that I have rinsed off in cold water. Okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead and use some of my seasoning and season the meat. Oh my gosh, that smells so good as soon as that hits the pan. Oh my gosh, this seasoning is so flavorful. You guys have to get some. It's like all you need to season your food. Like your sauces, your meats, your veggies, like everything. All you need. So good. Okay, so we're going to let this sear on one side. And then when it's ready, we're going to flip it, season the other side. Okay, so this looks ready to flip. So while the steak is searing, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up this um, red onion so that when we take the steak out, it's ready to add to the pan. So I'm gonna do that real quick. All right, so we got our onion nice and chopped up. All right, let's go uh, check on the steak. All right, so this steak is looking good. I'm gonna go ahead and flip it one more time. Ooh. Okay, and I'm going to turn my heat on low. I'm just going to cook it for like a couple more seconds and then take it off. Over here, I have um, a pot of water starting to boil for our pasta. All right. Okay, so this looks good. We're going to take the steak out and let it rest. Okay, I'm going to try. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and take this out. Alright, now we're going to add the onions. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and cook these onions and all this nice steak fat, steak juices. Just um, cook them down some. Mm, that smells so good. Okay, so these are looking good. I'm going to go ahead and add in a tablespoon of minced garlic. Alright. I'm going to mix this up. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. Yum. 
All right, next we're gonna add in our grape tomatoes. I did rinse them off. Okay. So now let's stir this around. All right, so I turned my fire down. I'm just gonna make a space in the middle to put our feta cheese. Okay. All right, so here's our feta. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna top the feta with some Italian seasoning. All right. And a little bit of my seasoning blend. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put the top on this and let it cook for a little bit. While that's cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and add the pasta. So our steak has been resting. I'm gonna go ahead and slice this up. All right, so we sliced up the steak. Oh my gosh, you guys. I tasted a piece and it's so good. So flavorful, so juicy. Oh my gosh, it's so good. So what I wanna do is I'm gonna put 90% of this in the pasta and then I'm gonna leave a little bit off. Um, and then I'm gonna leave a little bit out just for garnish for my pictures, okay? So most of this is gonna go in the pot. The rest is gonna be for garnish. Oh, it's so good. It's so juicy, so flavorful. Oh my gosh. All right, so our pasta's ready. Let's drain it. All right, let's check the feta and tomatoes. Oh yeah, that's ready. Let's add the drained pasta. All right, we added the pasta. Let's season our noodles. Gonna put a little bit more Italian seasoning. A little bit more of my spice blend. Now let's toss it together. Oh, that feta is so soft and creamy. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. It's so creamy. Mmm. This smells so good. Alright, let's add in our steak. Alright, let's mix this all together. It's so nice and creamy. Okay, let's go ahead and plate this up. Okay, y'all, look! Here is my one pot feta pasta with steak. Look at how beautiful that looks. Oh my gosh, this pasta is so creamy. There's like cheese all up in that penne. The steak is so flavorful and juicy. These, plump, these uh, great tomatoes are so juicy. This is so good. Okay. Y'all, this is... Mm, mm, mm. Go ahead. Of course, y'all get the first bite. Here y'all go. Look at, look at that meat. Here, take this first bite. All this meat. Oh, here y'all go. Mm. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next video. Yeah, I got to taste it for y'all. Oh my gosh, this pasta looks so creamy. Oh, whoa, look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Whoa, don't slip up or get caught. Why not, man? I'm coming for that number.